Hi, this is Hilal. In this video on Mathematical Economics series, we will learn how to find the marginal expenditure function from the given supply function and evaluate it at specific points. The question is like this. Find marginal expenditure function uh, associated with the supply function. We are being given a supply function that is P is equal to Q square plus 2Q plus 1. This is our supply function where P is the price and Q denotes the quantity. We have to evaluate at Q is equal to 4 and Q is equal to 10. Okay, how do we solve this very type of question? Simply, so we are being given the supply function. We have to find out the marginal expenditure function. Okay, so our supply function is P is equal to Q square uh, plus 2Q plus 1. This is our supply function. Now, to calculate the marginal expenditure function, first we need to find out the total expenditure function and what is the total expenditure function when we are being given the supply function simply uh, our total expenditure function is total expenditure function is equal to uh, price into output okay so if this is our uh, uh, you know the supply function to this we multiply q to get our total expenditure function okay so we have uh, p is being given as is q square uh, plus 2q plus 1 to this we multiply q and we will get uh, multiplying this q to each of these terms so we will get here uh, q cube uh, plus 2 q square uh, plus q okay this is our total expenditure function okay i hope i am making myself clear now to get that marginal expenditure function marginal expenditure function what we need to do we just ne uh, need to take the derivative of this total expenditure function with respect to output that means taking derivative of total expenditure function uh, with respect to quantity okay so taking derivative of this very function simply the derivative of q cube will be equal to 3 q square okay this is uh, 3 Q square okay simply the exponent uh, uh, first the exponent becomes coefficient and exponent is subtracted by 1 by the power function rule okay similarly we have this uh, 2 and we have exponent as 2 if exponent becomes coefficient it will get multiplied with this 2 so 2 2's are 4 uh, 4 Q uh, plus the derivative of Q will be 1 okay so this is our marginal expenditure function which we derived from the total expenditure function and the total expenditure function has been derived from our supply function just multiplying the supply function with quantity okay now we need to evaluate this at q is equal to 4 and q is equal to 10 now when q is equal to uh, when q is equal to 4 okay when our q is equal to 4 what will be our marginal expenditure marginal expenditure will be equal to just plug the value of q into the marginal expenditure function to get the marginal expenditure at that point so we have 3 in place of q we have 4 square uh, plus 4 into the value of q is q uh, 4 plus 1 okay so this is uh, 3 into 4 4 are 16 uh, plus uh, here 4 4 are 60 again uh, plus 1 okay so 36 into uh, sorry 3 into uh, 16 is 48 sorry 48 plus 16 plus 1 which comes out to be over so that's a good panda so that get past this year so our marginal expenditure when output is equal to you know 4 is equal to 65 and similarly uh, when q is equal to 10 okay now uh, when q is equal to 10 marginal expenditure will be equal to just plug at uh, this time the value of q is equal to 10 in this uh, in this marginal expenditure function to get the marginal expenditure at this point okay so we are 3 into 10 square uh, plus 4 into 10 plus 1 so this is 3 10 uh, 10 tens are go 100 100 into 3 is 300 plus uh, this is 40 uh, 40 plus 1 this comes out to be 341 okay so our marginal expenditure is equal to 341 when our output level is 10 and marginal expenditure is 65 when our output level is 4 okay i hope i make myself clear in this video thank you